welcome Ophiosis, Ophiosis, Ophiosis. What is going on? I've never seen this for you, Ophiosis. All right, Ophiosis, I want to say thank you so much for returning. Let's go in and see what's happening with your reading. A whole lot of worries is in the center of your reading. Let's recognize where this worries is coming from. How can you resolve this worry? So the ten of the nine of cups is in reverse, Ophiosis, whatever you are hoping for, Jupiter in Pisces. Jupiter in Pisces is about uh, some sort of a um relationship uh, um with um people on the work floor, okay? So uh, some of you Ophiosis could have gotten involved with um with some sort of a professional and financial relationship on the work floor okay and uh, it is costing you a whole lot of anguish and pain a whole lot of anguish and pain so ophiosis um this is why i always said uh, when you're in a professional field um relationship on the work floor doesn't really work okay um you need to recognize that work is work and professional is professional okay I see a Pisces woman is all is, is is having some sort of a anguish, um, because some of you Ophios has got in some sort of a relationship with this person. Uh, you have ended this relationship on the 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 work floor. This is someone who you work with. You have uh, ended this relationship, and I see anguish, worries is coming up, um, because this woman is going to be creating some sort of a obstacles. Okay, so. Ladies and gentlemen, um, separate your professional life. I've always said that to people. You gotta separate your professional life, um, from your private life. Okay. A lot of you, um, the first week is dealing with water of water. Water of water is a, a Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion person. It is coming up as a Pisces person because it is the Nine of Cups. So, and this Nine of Cups is Jupiter in Pisces, okay? Jupiter in Pisces. And what Jupiter in Pisces is that some of you had some sort of a, a work relationship, um, some sort of a intimacy with someone of the work floor, and it's a Pisces. And now this Pisces is sad, sad, and is in anguish because you have ended a relationship. And this is costing you a lot of um, problem on the work floor because this woman is a, now going to be working against you and this is what you need to understand um uh a lot of people do not understand no matter when they come with whatever no 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 it's work i have my relationship um do not have a relationship with people on the work floor because this is what is transpiring the energy of the devil is here energy of the devil um, is costing a lot of you a lot of worries, pain, and anguish at the work. And what you're going to be transpiring is that uh, um, this energy is associated with an Aries. A lot of people say that the devil is associated with a Capricorn. Some Capricorns can be very vicious, that I can explain to you. But this energy of the devil is about... Um, a boss that is creating a whole lot of anguish for a lot of you. Okay, so um, a, a lot of you are dealing with your boss and this person is making you have sleepless nights. Okay, and an a, a, a end is going to be coming into this person. Whoever this boss is, an end is coming up for this person because people are now recognizing that this boss and this person has been creating um, sleepless night for a lot of people. A lot of people are, are not happy, but they can't leave the job because they need uh, um, to be uh, financial stable. I see a lot of you who have a, a Leo boss is going to be leaving. This Leo boss has been creating a lot of pro um, problems and ang ang anxiousness for a lot of people on the work floor. They are going to be releasing this boss. So a lot of you, a lot of you was uh, having issues and problem with your boss and um this is it now we have the nine of swords the nine of swords is mars in gemini a whole lot of cruelty that this person has done to a lot of you okay and um some of you could have a 
Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion, woman who was your boss, this woman had done you a lot of cruelty, and now you are recognizing this, okay? So I see um, Mars in Gemini is that people are going to be, um, you know, speaking up. A team of people are going to be speaking up about a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion boss and a Leo boss who have been affecting you and has been giving you sleepless night. Whether it's your boss, whether it's your supervisor, whoever these people are, you are going to be recognizing that these people have been creating a whole lot of the issues and I see an end is coming up for a Leo boss and a Pisces Cancer Scorpion person who had worked together in order to create a whole lot of instability and problems for you guys, okay? Then we're looking at the second week. What is happening in the second week? We have the Six of Pentacles, Moon in Taurus, the Moon in Taurus. So I see help is going to be coming in and a lot of you are going to be awarded Um um, help. A lot of you are going to be receiving some sort of a, a powerful position because um, your performance is good at work. Okay. So wonderful Ophiosis. Um, you Ophiosis have been trying to resolve some sort of a situation, working on some sort of a situation and creating some sort of a situation where you are going to be releasing some people out of some sort of an anguish where they were dealing with um, these bosses or super, uh, supervisors that has created some sort of an anguish, some sort of a problem. It could be bosses, supervisor, but it could be also um, colleagues that was creating a whole lot of sleepless nights where a lot of people, and they have con um, collaborated together in order to go and let personnel know what was happening and how these people were feeling. And um, now I see that... Uh, a lot of you um, with the energy of the moon in uh, Taurus, this is rewards that is going to be coming in and help um, from people in powerful position is going to be coming in, okay? So aid and help from uh, someone in a powerful position is going to be coming in for you guys. So this is going to be good, so wonderful. Then we look at judgment is in reverse, now, the energy of judgment and whenever judgment comes up or in a business reading is that some sort of a unexpected news is going to be coming in. And where it's coming from is that the help is going to be coming in. Pluto, a tower moment is going to be coming down. So this is going to be good. So a lot of you who were being... Um, being judged unfairly, I see people are going to be coming in and it's going to be helping you out because they recognize how unfairly you were judged and how unfairly people have worked against you and created a whole lot of problems and issues on the false pretend, on the not being honest, just um, the true um, jealousy um, and hate that was going on. They're going to be recognizing and I see unexpectedly with this judgment call is a Pluto is going to be removing and ending some sort of a competition and strive that was going on. So yay, 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 congratulations. Um, you are leaving this period with the ending of competition and strive. So Saturn is in Leo. We see the five of rods. Saturn is in Leo. And um, the help that is going to be coming in, the help is going to be coming in in order to release a lot of you from some unprofessional um, group of people that had created a whole lot of issues around you. And people are now recognizing that these people was because of hate and jealousy, why they have done and created all these problems and issue and having these competition and conflicts around you is because of jealousy, jealousy, unwanted um, jealousy, just hate and jealousy, jealousy because you have accomplished a whole lot in your life, jealousy because you are not like these people. So I see uh, and Leo is now worried. A whole lot of problems. And Leo is now worried. A Aries and a Leo is now worried. It's as if uh, the, this Aries and this Leo was placed, was been, um, has been creating a whole lot of issues for a lot of you 
and now people are now recognizing what these two bosses had done and what these two supervisors had done and how they have uh, um, used their powers in a wrong way in order to create a lot of instabilities for a lot of you and a lot of you were like just afraid afraid of these people just don't know um what to say and um how to deliver any information so i see um they are going to be removed um people are now recognizing how far um a situation has played out and how um a whole lot of you you ophiosas are recognizing that people were trying to ruin other people's reputation for no reason at all and now what um is transpiring is that uh, um um whoever these three people are it's an aries uh it's a pisces cancer scorpion and a leo they are now worried they are now worried and i see um you ophiosis are recognizing because you're stepping in and in v and into and stepping in and is um really um investigating an horrible situation that has taken place so, where a lot of colleagues on the work floor was being um, pressured and powered um, by other people. And I see because of you, of your sustained your, your grounds and really recognize what was going on, um, you will be offered and honored for doing this. So I see that, uh, um, you know, it could be an international company where some of you were in another place and whoever these three people were, were using their powers in the wrong way. And people and workers were really um letting um you ophios know exactly what was transpiring you ophios has, has gotten to the bottom of the situation and recognized the undesirable way that these people were treating these um employees so so you ophios this is absolutely going to be beautiful there is no question about it because um what is happening is that you ophios recognize uh, the unfair game from a lot of people who were um, using their powers uh, in their wrong ways. These were managers, these were supervisors, these were, you know, it could have been a house that was supposed to be protecting people and that sort of a thing. And how they used their powers against uh, these people who needed uh, um, their help. And they knew that they were in a position to manipulate uh, anything that was going on, but it's as if the universe stopped in and helped them to find someone, someone who would have recognized um, that uh, um, what they were doing was not correct. So you, Ophiosis, was the only one who was recognizing that people were really using their powers to their own advantage and was creating for themselves wealth, and these workers or employees was not treated correctly. And I see you, Ophiosis, is going to be um, stepping in and bringing this situation back in balance. So um, it's good what you, Ophiosis, are doing because you are ending the strife, the competition, the horrible way of how workers were being treated unfairly. And it's recognizing the, that it was three people three managers, three boss, or three employees, three colleagues that was creating these uh, imbalances uh, situation and was making people feeling uncomfortable. People were leaving um, the company and people weren't aware why, um, you know, people were just coming in and leaving and they're now, now going to be recognizing that uh, a lot of people did not make it uh, um, a comfortable environment uh, um, for the workers and this is the reason why the workers just got up and left for the job so wonderful alignment from energies um um of yours is I, you're in for you know a really beautiful new start i remember if you were born in november uh, 29 until december 17 this is your reading in order for you to pick up the extended um you have to use the blue button that says join on the subscription um so there is a blue button that say join if you join the first um section you will have these reading if not i am saying namaste until the bi-monthless i do love you guys 
um, please remember to show your love by thumbs up so that it picks up the al algorithm. Okay, that means thumbs up is that yes, you have watched it. It picks up the algorithm. I see you on the other side. If not, I will speak to you in the bi-monthlies.